This is a very easy process to create this effect. Now for the sake of demonstration, I am only keeping a few layers here. As you can see right here, let me delete this one. As you can see that there are three layers, this one and this one, the circuit one, the last layer which will be revealed after the brush stroke had been painted. So let me turn this off and right here you can see that base layer is there. Now all you have to do is that you have to create another fill layer. So this fill layer will be act as the paint mask. So let me duplicate this one and then after that alt click here in this uh, color channel. So this will isolate the color channel and then after that turn this off. So this is a good tip that it can help you to save some time rather than turning off like this. So this will only consume some time. I mean it is very good to save some time. So and after that all you have to do is that you have to create a black mask here and then after that uh, you have to assign an anchor point here. Okay so uh, let's name any I mean rename this anything. Okay so after that all you have to do is there paint any random stroke so you can see the effect is coming so right now we had not assigned anyone so let me uh, paint any random stroke here so right now we had uh, created a stroke here and right after that we have this layer now all you have to do is that you have to create a group here so we had created a group now for different type of layer they will have a their own individual group so this one have their own individual group so right here all you have to do create a black mask i mean add a black mask and right after that click here add fill layer and then after that here go to here and anchor point now you will select this uh, anchor point which you had created here so let's select this one okay so the effect is visible now let's go to another uh, layer so we will create another uh, group so let's assign it a black mask fill layer and select this anchor point so you can see here but the thing is that it is not looking um, convincing i mean you can all you have to do is that let's turn this off i mean all you have to do is that you have to adjust the label here as you can see right here the spread amount so also adjust the label here let's uh, increase the spread of this one so you can adjust according to yourself and one more thing is that you can add some like you can add some more filter to make it look more interesting in this one so we had create added a filter this is called warp effect and right here you can add more uh, filter to make it uh, look a little bit over interesting and add your own details so you can add sharpen also here make sure you assign any color so you, it is very easy for to you uh, to recognize this one and then after that let me add sharpen filter reduce it so so we have this effect and now if you want to paint some more stroke make sure you had not selected this one you have to select this one so you can see here that this uh, fill layer i mean this uh, what we call and uh, the anchor layer so they had referenced this two layer which you had created a reference form here if i'm right so you have to make sure that you had selected this one if you had not selected this one you are not able to paint the effect so you have to select this layer where you had created the anchor so right now you can see that you are able to see the interesting details so this will add some uh, interesting storyline details so this is very easy one now thing is that if you want to add another effect i mean another material all you have to do is that drag any random one 
and then after that uh, add a group to this layer black mask fill layer anchor point it's very easy so adjust, adjust it according to yourself let's change its color just for the sake of demonstration so let's also adjust adjust the level little bit okay so right now you can see that we had created uh, three layers so let's remove all those strokes let's do it again this is very interesting so let me paint the strokes right now you can see here so interesting so you can adjust according to, uh, the brush setting according to your need to make it a little bit more fun so this is very amazing have fun with this one so comrade we will meet in next video goodbye